Hello, hello everyone. This is David Jagna with Upload VR, and today we're going to be playing some Walkabout Mini Golf. Uh, the stream did not exactly go as planned. I was planning on having us play multiplayer uh, with me and Ian from Upload VR, like we did last week in Real VR Fishing, but for whatever reason, this game does not cast audio to a cast device if you're in a multiplayer game. So if I was playing um, a quick match against a random person or if I played a private match against Ian, um, no matter what, if I'm in a multiplayer lobby, this game did not cast any audio to my cast device. No audio chat, no game sounds, nothing. It was total silence. Um, I tested it for about 30, 40 minutes going back and forth between different devices and I don't know what it is about this game's privacy settings or whatever they've done, but they do not cast audio whenever you're in a multiplayer match. So it's a little, it was a little frustrating. I wasn't able to make this a multiplayer stream like I wanted. Uh, so sorry about that, everyone. Uh, hello, hello, Brandon, controller player, G Dog, Alex, BD, Monkey, and everyone else. Hello, hello. Try the new goth course, please. It has original music, no copyright concerns. Okay, Brandon. Um, maybe I'll do a couple holes of this first one because I've I've never played this game before, and then we'll see how it goes. We'll see we'll see where I'm at um, after that. Um, if anyone has any questions or anything at all, let me know in the chat. I'll do my best to respond. Um, RG, I don't think it's a firewall issue. That doesn't make sense to me. I don't. Maybe you can explain what you mean. I've literally never had this problem with any other game ever at all before. Um, I don't think it's anything on my end. That would be very strange. Um, like I said, never had this problem before with any other game. Um, okay, so let's see here. Swing from the shoulders for maximum control. All right. Oh, okay. That was a little too strong, but that's okay. And I'm sorry that there's no webcam today either. Um, another inexplicable technical problem. Webcam literally just won't show up in OBS today. Don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, we're just going without a webcam. You guys can pretend that I'm standing there in the corner of the screen. And bam! Oh, come on. There we go. Look at that. Cheers all around, everybody. One thing that I really like so far... Oh, Trigger just teleports you there. That's awesome. Okay. Uh, one thing that I'm liking a lot so far is that all the courses are actually connected. Like, this is a real mini golf course. I've played a lot of other VR golf games that just kind of have each hole as its own, like, floating platform or something weird like that. But this one, it actually, you're on a real course. Like, it feels like you're playing actual mini golf, which is pretty sweet. Uh, let me let me check on chat real quick. Okay, click trigger automatically. Nice, nice, cool. Thank you, everybody. Um, let's see other comments. Just in time to see Hut of the Century. Yeah, I'm sure. Happy Gilmore. That's okay. Yeah, that's a good idea, G Dog. I'm gonna Happy Gilmore this baby. Here we go. Let's see. I'm gonna get back as far as I can in this room that I'm in. Is this enough room to run up and hit it? No, it's not. Okay. Let's see here. Okay, that, that that's pretty close. Let me get a little further over here. Okay, that's that's pretty good, right? I think I can get some torque on that one. Wait, nope, I've rotated too much. I'm now running into a TV. That's not a good idea. Here we go. Oh, would you look at the... Whoa, oh my god. <laughs> it feels very good. Like this... It feels pretty nice. It's too bad I'm, I'm really bad. But, you know, if it wasn't for that, this would be really nice. There we go. 
Look at your wrist. Oh, okay. Okay, so this one is par three. Okay. So what I would like to do is hit it, bounce off of that, and go straight in. Like, that's the ultimate goal, right? That's the ideal way of handling this one. I'm guessing that's not going to happen. Nope. <gasps> oh, that, that was almost in there. And, okay, let's see if we can get this one. Oh, I shanked it, man. Okay. I keep curving to the left, okay. I gotta keep that in mind. There we go, that was better. That was better. Got a bogey, that's okay. They added a replay feature last week, press B or Y after the shot. Oh! Would you look at that? That's pretty cool. Oh, that's nice. That's a nice little feature. Okay, there's a full scorecard. See, I'm very consistent. I'm not good, but I'm consistent, you know? Whoa, this is the whole course. I didn't even realize that. Oh my gosh. This is crazy. Seeing it all spread out like this is really cool. That's awesome. That's a cool feature. I like that. How's everybody doing today? What's everybody been playing? We had our uh, episode of the podcast yesterday where we chatted about the latest VR games we've been checking out. <clears throat> Original Gothic. Okay, this is the one you're talking about. Um, let's do the front nine only. Let's, how about we try that? You know what? If, if you guys want, what I can do is I can actually show you. So you hear that background audio right now? You hear how there's background audio and everything? As soon as I go into a private match, or even a quick match, it doesn't matter. If I click and try to join into a multiplayer game, listen. There you go. It all cut out instantly. You now cannot hear anything for no reason whatsoever, really. And then you go to leave room. Now watch. Give it a second. There it is. And now the audio's back. I don't know why they did that. Uh, do I think the Gorn will be crossed by from Quest to PC VR? Uh, I don't know, Jacob. That's a good question. I, w I would assume not. You can see the other tiny players on the course when you hit... Oh, that's cool. That's really cool. Okay, let's do original Gothic. That one's been requested, right? Oh, man. This is much more advanced than the little tiny course that I was on a second ago. Oh, boy. Okay. All right, we got to actually time this. Oh, come on, man. Really? You know what? I'm going to be that guy. Hold on. Is there a setting in here? Is maybe is that why? No. Okay. I'm going to be that guy. I'm going to I'm going to restart the whole level because I messed up on the first hit. Okay. Ahem. <clears throat> Let me show you how it's done, everybody. All right, there. <gasps> Ooh, that was actually really good. Okay, all right, all right. Let's tap that one on in there, okay. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, round of applause. Yes, yes. I, I got par. I'm uh, I'm actually a prodigy at this. Yeah, I don't know if you realize. Okay, this one, that's a cool statue. I like the, I like the rain, the little subtle, subtle rain droplets. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna aim for this for this side here. I'm gonna try to go for that corner. Nope. That's the exact opposite. 
but I'm gonna I'm gonna roll with it. What's this one? This is a par three. Okay, I'm uh, probably not gonna get that, but we'll try. Okay, let's see here. Nope. There we go. Let's rotate this way. No! That's not what I wanted. That's terrible. Okay, I see what I gotta do. I gotta angle it. I gotta go like that. Yeah! Okay. Now see, this is where VR comes in handy. In real life, I wouldn't be able to swing back like this, but here, in VR, I can phase through objects. See that? And I can... Uh, just I can miss just like that and uh, now we can go ahead and uh, there you go tap it in I got a, a double bogey double bogey takes a special kind of talent to get a double bogey Dr. Nightblade how am I a cheater And G-Dog said, if I wanted, I could have the background music like last time and play with someone. You wanted... Uh, I don't know what you mean. I can't. Like I said, like I showed, the uh, it doesn't work. Audio does not work when you're doing multiplayer. I can show you guys again if you want. I can prove it. There we go. Is this one a, oh, this is a par three? Okay. There's a chance that I can make this. This is possible, okay? This is entirely possible here. Let's try to position just right. I don't want to get all the way up next to it. I don't like how close it puts you. Uh, let's go. There it is, baby. Look at that. Look at that. Birdie. I might just quit playing this game right now and just never come back again. Yes, G-Dog, you could hear me, but you could not hear any game audio, is what I'm saying. Whenever I cast to a cast device and try to join a multiplayer lobby, whether that be private or public, the game audio and the chat audio of whoever I'm playing disappears on the cast device it does not go to obs cast device doesn't display it you cannot hear a single thing is what i'm saying you can still hear my mic because my mic's connected to my computer it's irrelevant the game audio cuts out completely i can show you again if you want after i'm done with this level <clears throat> okay how many is this one this is a part three whoa oh my gosh oh my gosh <gasps> I don't deserve this, but okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. Yeah, 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 yeah. That, that was on purpose. That was totally on purpose. There we go. That's exactly what I... <laughs> That's exactly what I meant to do. That was not an accident at all. No, it's okay, g -Dog. No worries. That was sick. Okay, now this one is complete garbage, because as you can see here, it wants me to go through this little tiny gap, and then it has a whole hill on the other side with a par two. This is ridiculous. This is stupid. I don't, I, this one's unfair. I'm going to say it right now. This isn't even cool. I don't like this one. There's not a single thing about me that thinks this is going to be a fun one. Can I just pop it up? Like, can you... Okay, if I can just, just enough speed to get it into the, oh man, blew it, totally blew it. Yeah, totally blew it. That's okay, it's alright, it's alright, we'll make it up, don't worry guys, we'll make it up. Okay, what's the trick here? Why is this a par 3? I don't understand what's going on. Something feels fishy. I'm very confused. 
How is that a par two and this is a par three? Can someone explain that to me? <gasps> oh, yeah. Wait. Oh, that's why. Where did it come from? I'm so confused. Did it shoot out of there? Wow, that's crazy. Okay. Now it makes a little more sense. It makes a little more sense now. Okay. Let's see if I can get this one. That was devastating. I could have had another birdie. What's everyone been playing in VR lately? Anything good? Anything that I should check out that we haven't written about? Any recommendations? For hidden gems? Or maybe known gems that we've forgotten about? Hit me with your hit me with your recos. That's what the cool kids call it nowadays, the recos. Oh wow. I guess it could have gone worse. Not much worse, but it could have gone a little worse. This is a par three as well, of course it is. Of course it is. Nope. That was awful. Okay. No! <laughs> Man. <gasps> oh, that was a shot right there. That was that wasn't bad. Okay? You know, I'm going to take that as a win even though it's a triple bogey, a double bogey, whatever. Hey, Jimmis, what's up? The music comes on when you get inside the castle. Okay, cool, Brandon. That's good to know. Hyperdash. Is, is the player base in, in Hyperdash good, Eric? Steven, yes. The Doom 3 port on Quest is nuts. If I had known the multiplayer wasn't going to work in this, I probably would have just streamed that. Whoa, what the heck? I've got... Why is headset battery low? Okay, it says charging. I've got my, uh, my VR power plugged in. So it's charging. We should be good. Hopefully it doesn't die, like last time. That was annoying. I didn't have it plugged in last time. I have it plugged in right now. Maybe the VR power wasn't turned on, I guess. Oh, look at that shot! <gasps> oh, that was close. Okay, this is it. I feel good about this one. There we go, baby. You unlock the night version, which is more difficult after you complete the daytime version. Yeah, I saw that for each level. Thank you for the info. This game's pretty awesome. I can imagine how much better it is and <clears throat> how much better it would be in multiplayer. It's a bummer the audio doesn't work for casting. Okay, let me try... Oh, would you look at that? Threaded the needle. Okay, I'm not going to get par on this one, though. It's a par two somehow. Which is just a cruel, cruel thing to do to somebody. Let's try this. What do you guys think? Am I going to get this one? Do I got it? Do I got it? Does he have it? No, he doesn't. See, I'm curving to the right now. I was curving to the left earlier. <clears throat> oh, my gosh. I keep overcorrecting to too far whenever I curve. I gotta get it down the middle. There, that, that was better. Vert Chill, you were correct. I did not get it. I had an incredible shot earlier though. I'm just gonna put that out there into the universe that I have had some success so far. Not everything has been terrible. Okay, so it falls down in there so I can't even see really where it's gonna go. This one is pretty much entirely random. Who knows where it's going to end up down there.
Ooh! <gasps> oh, man. That was so close. That was incredibly close. Let me turn off the very light background music I had going anyway. Best multiplayer Oculus game on the market. Protein Shake. It's pretty good. I like it a lot so far. This is quite nice. I don't know if you saw earlier what I said is we were planning to do a multiplayer stream, but for some inexplicable reason in this game, whenever you are in a multiplayer lobby with someone else, it does not cast any of the audio to your cast device. So I stream Quest using a Google Chromecast uh, plugged into an HDMI splitter. And um, it doesn't cast audio if I'm in a multiplayer lobby. I don't know why. I've never had a game do that before. But this one does. It, it cuts off all audio. Um, okay, so there. I go through the wall. Okay. And then, okay, let me take a peek here. Let me face through the wall real quick. Okay. Okay, so then I have to go through the other gate. All right. I can do that. I can do that, right? You guys uh, f feel confident in me, in my abilities here? Let's, uh, let's just sink it. I'm not going to overthink it. I'm just going to go with the flow. There it is. There it is. Money. Money. Look at that. That's not bad. This is a par four. Oh, baby. Let's see here. Hang on. Uh, which which uh, opening do I want to go for? This is in the middle. So I want to hit probably... Hmm, I think my best bet will just be going straight down, right? I think that's exactly what I want to do. Is I just want to hit right in there. That's exactly how I want it to go. Did I make it? Oh, it sucks I couldn't see it. Oh my god. Alright. Alright, I'm just gonna say it. I'm 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 the greatest player at Walkabout Mini Golf VR of all time. I'm just I'm gonna put that out there. Blind shot. Couldn't even see the hole. Eagle, baby. That's how you do it. Right there. Right there. Take notes. Take notes, boys and girls. That's how you play. That's how you play. Oh, replay. That's right, Brandon. Thank you. Before I went too far. Okay. Uh, go back. Go back. Oh, that was close, too. Hold up. There's me right there. Boom. Oh, that was right around the edge. That was... I'm, I'm proud of that. I, I don't care. I don't care what anyone says. I'm, I'm very proud of that shot. Of all time, that's right. The view from the headset paired. Uh, what I do is I have my Oculus Quest uh, casting to a Chromecast Ultra. My Chromecast Ultra is plugged into an HDMI splitter to get rid of the HDCP protection. And then my uh, splitter is plugged into an Elgato capture card, which is then plugged into my computer for OBS. Uh, we have a whole guide on it uh, at uploadvr.com. If you just Google how to stream Oculus Quest, you, you will probably find our guide at uploadvr. But that's the uh, basics of how you do it. Hidden balls at every hole to find collectibles. Then you can choose to play with any of those. Okay, was that what I saw back there? Was that a hidden ball? Um, over here. Whoops. Is that what's in that mouth? I don't know. How do you get it? I don't know. Oh, there. There we go. So you're telling me every single hole in the entire game has a hidden ball somewhere all of them that's a lot can I switch here or does that have to be back in the menu settings putter blah 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 okay 
Oh, we got moving block puzzle now. Okay. Now it's getting more serious. It's getting a little more serious now, guys. Every hole? That's crazy. If you find all of them, you'll unlock night mode. Back before you choose course. Okay, thanks, Brandon. Thanks, everybody. You have to find every hidden ball to unlock night mode, or you just have to complete the course to unlock night mode? I thought you just had to complete the course. Okay, this one's a par three. All right. Ah, just barely curved it wrong way. Dang it. So what do you guys think? I had webcam problems today. I wasn't able to um, have my webcam on the stream. Do you prefer whenever you can see me down there in the corner? Do you like that better? Or do you like it like this, where it's just the game? You just need to complete the course with a decent score. Okay. Got it, got it. Oh my gosh. That was awful. That was so bad. Thank you. Thank you for the round of applause. You okay with either G Dog? Webcam preferred as long as it's not too big. Yeah. Yeah, I, I keep it very tiny. If you've ever watched any of our streams on here before. Yeah, I keep it in, I keep it in the corner. Um, I usually put it in whatever corner has the least amount of information. Um, usually bottom left corner in most games. And I usually try to use a green screen if I can. Um, either virtual or physical. For some reason OBS is, was acting so weird today. It wouldn't let me um, put, my, put my webcam in. So I was like, just whatever, you know. I had so many other technical problems. I was just willing to just sacrifice the webcam today. And look at that. Money in the bank. That's what that is. Give it to me. Oh, man. That was close. That was close. All right. I can, I can get a birdie still. There we go. Birdie, birdie, birdie. G-Dog, I have a Logitech C920. It works really well. It's the first time this ever happened. Try Mixed Reality Paired Pro. I don't have the, the space for it. I just don't have the room. Maybe whenever we move into our new house, I'll try to do that in my office, but it's unlikely. I just don't have the space to do it well. <clears throat> if I was going to do it, I would want to do it well. Not just kind of like half-assed torso. Hold on. Hold on. Look at that. Oh, I, I found a ball. There we go. Okay, let me get as close as possible. Okay, hang on, let me... There we go. Boom. Another birdie. Add all the birdies to my collection, everybody. Just hold the... Oh, okay, you don't have to kneel down like that? Okay. Good to know. I thought you had to physically get your hand to touch it. Okay, so there's a drop-off here. Right? There's not a ramp. It's a drop. And then... Is there an opening in this? No. Okay, so I have to get it. Okay, so this is ramped. This is an incline right here. So, ideally, I want to bank it around this. Because then that'll act as a ramp. And I could potentially get it all the way over there. Because this is a par 3. So I don't want... I want to get speed, but I don't want to... Oh, there's a ball. I don't want it to bounce out.
Okay, so I think that's what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to hit this curve. Are you serious? Headset battery low again? It says charging, but it's still going down. All right, guys, there's a chance that my headset's going to die. You know what? How about I just plug it in? Maybe I'll just actually plug it in, you know? I don't need to move around that much with this game. Because <clears throat> this battery is not charging very quickly. And I'm going to assume that my actual charger here is going to charge it faster. Or, you know what? I don't know, actually. Because my wall charger doesn't have very much room on it at all. I should have charged my quest before I started streaming. If you go to a cycle around and then be behind that obstacle. You're right, Craig. You're right. That is good observation. Yeah, my headset's going to die. Um, okay. I'm going to try plugging in and just see if I can deal with the, the short... Where's the plug? There we go. Okay, it should be charging very, very fast now. Come on, what are you doing? It's definitely plugged on the wall. Come on. I should have charged my battery before we started doing this and my quest. Yeah, casting really does eat away at the battery, Craig. You're absolutely right. It makes the drain much faster. Okay, what is happening here? Oh, you know what? I forgot. I forgot, guys. Hold on a second. Okay, sorry about that. I had forgotten that I unplugged my charger because I was uh, I was playing my Dreamcast yesterday and I needed an extra outlet because I don't have enough outlets in this room. And my extension cords are all used up, so I just decided to unplug the Quest charger. And that's what caused all of these problems from the very beginning. Racing the clock here like a bomb county. <laughs> that's right, Mike. Uh, do I have a stand for my headset where you can plug it in? No, I don't. I've got a corner where the cord dangles. I want to get that charger dock that uh, is, uh, I think it just came out. People have been receiving them. There we go. Look at that. It's going up. It's going up. We're saved, everybody. We're saved. Okay. I'm going to try to curve it. I'm going to do it. I hear your concerns. I understand the trepidation, but I'm going to go for it. I'm going to curve it around, and I'm going to... I'm going to at least get par. I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Don't worry. Let's see, watch this. Look at that. Look at that. It could have been better, but that was pretty good. That's, that's pretty much exactly what I wanted it to do. It could have ended up a little bit better, but that was not bad. Oh, my. <sighs> Curved it. Man, okay. Let's try to get par at least, right? All right, there we go. Getting par on that one, that's I'll, I'll count that as a win. Uh, paired, I am literally just walking over to my computer and lifting the headset up a little bit. Um, I'm trying to make it not super obvious, but it's uh, that's all I can do on Quest. They don't have any other option. Uh, in real VR fishing, that game lets you pop out a browser window inside the game. It's a feature the game has. So last week when I was streaming that, I was able to just look at chat inside the headset. It was glorious. It felt like I was on a PC headset. But unfortunately, Quest doesn't have that ability. Okay, so what are we dealing with here? We got one angle here. I could try to hit this and then bounce it. But then it gets no. I think a better course would be to try to hit, like, right there. Like, if I could plant it here and then bounce it that way that would be perfect or 
if I could just get it. You know what? Is this... No, this isn't an incline. That's like a crack. I thought this was a ramp, but it's not really. It's kind of bumpy. And then you run the risk of it going out that way. So I think... I think the right course of action here is to go for a ricochet off of that wall and then send it that way. That's what I'm going to try to do. We got a par 4, so if I mess up, it's not the end of the world. Charger dock from Anchor. Yes, that's the one that I want. I don't have grips on my controls. It is a ramp, it says Parrot. Oh, okay, stay right, it says Craig. Okay, okay. I don't know, guys. Okay, I think you might be right. If I'm looking at it from this angle, it does look like that is in fact a ramp. I think I was getting too close to it and I was like overthinking it. So that's, it looks like that is a ramp. So let's, let's try this. Let's try this. Oh no. Really? Okay, so those were cracks. That's what I thought was gonna happen. Okay, so let's, let's try this again. Well, that's not what I meant. And, uh, great. Perfect. Exact same spot. Oh, no. Oh, boy. This one cannot be going any worse right now. I'm just going to have to play it safe and just take the L here. Should have done this from the beginning. Oh, brutal. That's brutal. Oh my. <laughs> uh, I was doing really well, you guys. Like, I was. I felt like I was actually doing pretty well. And then everything came crashing down. Oh, God. Hole complete. Yeah, that's what it tells me now. Now I'm at a plus four. I think I was at a zero or a negative one earlier. On a beginner course, you can go straight. I think you can ricochet it off the right wall, but you have to hit it hard enough that it makes it up the ramp. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Thank you, Craig. I appreciate that. Okay, so I'm starting here. My hole is over there. So how does that work? So I sh hit the ball, comes here, and then I need to get it over there. Or, I mean, can I hit it over down the stairs? Is that an option? It looks like that's an option, guys. Can you do that? Can I hit this hit that way? It's risky because that's a very tiny opening. I'm not going to do it. I don't trust myself enough to be able to make that shot. I just want to get through one of those openings. That's all I care about right now. Oh, naturally, of course. Man. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, that looked like it was about to be real bad. Okay. I still have two more shots. I can, uh, I can salvage this. All right, who's going to give me a GG in the chat if I make this shot right now? If I get a birdie on this somehow. Let's see if it happens. Is it going to happen? If I make this shot right now, someone has to go to Amazon and buy an upload VR t-shirt. That's what you have to do. It's in the rules whenever you join the chat. I don't know if you saw it. It's in the rules. Ah, oh, brutal. Dang. Okay. I can still get par. Oh, come on! <laughs> no, come on. <sighs> oh my gosh. That's devastating. I thought I had it, guys. I really thought I had it. Amazon, empty my car. I'll give you an okay. <laughs> uh, I tried. Is this the last one? This is. 
Okay, what's going on here? I don't I don't understand this. Oh. Oh, this is like interesting. Inter this is ski ball, but it's the opposite. You want a low number. Huh. Okay. Okay. All right. Oh boy, okay. That was a little too hard. Let's go for that again. Look at that, I got the one. Oh, and that counts as a birdie? You know what, a plus four? That's not that bad. You know that, that's not that bad. I don't know what the check marks are. Oh, lost ball, okay. Plus four. I'll take it for my first, uh, my first course ever in this game. That's not that bad. I think you want the red. Mike Ward says heckin' good. There you go, heckin' good, everybody. That's the official endorsement of Mike Ward. The Mike Ward. Oh wait, no. Below par or collect ten balls. Oh. That's how you unlock the hard version. I should have uh, paid attention. Turns out paying attention helps. It's a good thing. We don't have any upload colors. Where is the green and black? I guess I have to go with this one. The eyeball. Alright, we're going to go back to the first level. And I'm going to get below par. That's what I'm going to do. We're starting over. Give it a medium-sized hit like you would at a regular miniature golf course where the ball disappears at the end. You make it sound so easy. You know that? You make it sound so easy, and it's not, you know? Because I suck. That's just what it is. That was a pretty good hit, all right? For my standards, that's like top tier. There we go. I'm dialed in this time, boys and girls. So fasten your seatbelts. You got a, this is also a par two, are you kidding me? All right. Let me get a little more space. Okay, so I'm gonna, I wanna curve it this way, I think. I would rather go this way. I will take that. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Give me. Give me, give me. All right. Boom. It's on my to-do list. Oh, wait. They're working on the Steam version. Nice, nice. No, the check marks are balls that you found along the course. Oh, okay, okay. Gotcha, gotcha. All right, this is a part three. Thank you, thank you. Give me a little more le uh, leeway here. Okay, so ideally, you would hit that, right? And you would bounce it. That's the plan. That's how physics works, I believe. Oh, my God. That was almost perfect. Wow. Wow. The eyeball ball is, uh, it's my calling, man. This ball was made for me. The Neversoft logo. <laughs> Isn't that what it looks like? It looks like the Neversoft logo. It looks like my mic audio might be a little too loud. It looks like it might be getting a little in the red. Okay, test, test, test. Yeah, that's better. You know what? I haven't been looking for the lost balls. I just completely forgot that was a thing. Yeah, right there. Look at that, I found one. How do I get it? I don't know. Maybe I can get it later. See, how do you go from hit the plank to the most elaborate system of 
weird trenches and slides and divots of all time. Look at this. In what universe does that make sense? Okay, so ideally I would hit this one. That's the one I want. Either this one or this one. The two middle ones suck. Okay, so I think I want the one on the left. That's the one I think has the better shot. So let's see if I can make that happen with my Never Self logo ball. Of course! Of course not! Why would I be able to hit the one that I want? That makes no sense. Why did I even think it was possible? Ooh, there we go. Alright, I'm, I'm sticking to par though, you know that? And, uh, look, I'm minus one right now, guys. I'm on track. This is, this is like Tiger Woods level prolific mini golf. Visualize yourself getting a hole in one. All right, just getting started. Thank you. Thank you for the tip. I'm going to visualize it and I'm going to make it happen. That's, that's the key to success. You have to visualize it. So if I hit like exactly right here, like a 90 degree angle, there we go. That's, that's math, you know? That's math right there. That's that's how it works in mathematics. And I'm going to do it. I'm going to visualize it. I'm going to do it because just getting started has that pro tip advice. Hang on, wait a second. Let me walk over here and then walk back. Oh, look, I'm more than halfway towards my calorie move goal for the day. What do you know? I'll tell you now how sedentary my life is. Let's see here. You know what? I'll take it. Let's get that. Come on. Come on. We can get that. I can still get a birdie. This is very birdieable. Is that a word? Oh, hey, there's a ball. What do you guys think? Am I, am I going to sink this putt right now? Am I, uh, am I enough of a gamer to make this putt right now? Does anyone want to know some fun? Yes, you dog That would be lovely. As a mini golf mini golfers I did a really great job thank you just getting started thank you can you be in every live stream from now on with your positivity this is lovely here we go I'm gonna make this I'm gonna sink it you know I'm just gonna visualize it and it's gonna happen it's gonna go in I can see it already happening I see it I see it it's happening it's ha there it is boom there it is birdie just like that. Minus two. Minus two. You know what? They could sell some DLC. Walkabout Mini Golf. The David Jagno edition. The David Jagno course pack. Upload VR course pack. You're getting dizzy. Kids don't drink and watch this video. <laughs> uh, sorry about that, Mini Pimmer. Proud of you. Thank you, just getting started. Thank you, thank you. Ketchup originated in China? Is that true, G-Dog? I guess your your name has cheeseburger in it, so you would know about ketchup. You're the uh, preeminent authority on ketchup here on YouTube. Man, it doesn't, it doesn't line you up right. I don't like the way it lines you up. I have to always, like, recenter it. It doesn't... Hang on, let me walk all the way over here and then back up. Now, okay, that's still not even... Whatever. Okay. This is a par three? Okay. Gotta avoid the water trap. There it is. That, oh my god. I didn't even know that would happen. How did that, oh, right there. This little edge, it hit that. That's perfect. I wonder if that's there on purpose. It must be, right? That's, like, I did what you're supposed to do. I think. Visualize it, make it happen. There it is. That's my new, uh, my new, my new uh, tag phrase. Do mosquitoes chew? What's your source? Mosquitoes have teeth? That's a good question. It depends on the person. I guess that was a... Thank you, Mike Ward. That was a good hole, right? You guys are talking about cheeseburgers and mosquitoes, and I'm over here sinking putts. 
So keep it up. Whatever you're doing is working. I wonder is is this like like does it trick you? Does this hole shoot out here? Or does it like actually go over here? Like is this a fake out situation? Because it totally could be. I don't know. It could easily be a fake out situation. What do you guys think? Is it a fake out situation? Are they trying to trick me? It's getting too intellectual, Wikipedia man. Please remain quiet while this gentleman masks his way into the hole. <laughs> that is the first time someone's ever called me a gentleman, so thank you. I'll, I'll take that as a compliment. I'm going to assume it's not tricking me. I don't think it's going to trick me. See the ball in the hole. There you go. Just getting started. Back with that advice. Here we go. There's my eyeball ball. My never stop logo ball. I'm going to go in that hole down there. This is a par 3, everybody. I think this one is supposed to be targeted to where I, I can make it if I get in this hole. I think that's the intention, right? Let's see. If I make this, if I hit that hole right now, if I do it in one shot, everyone in chat has to go buy an upload VR t-shirt on Amazon. I don't make the rules. I'm just, I'm just letting you know. Oh, that... First it almost went in there and I had a mini heart attack and then it almost went in there and I almost got excited. Let's try it here. Come on, why doesn't it go faster? That's stupid. That's dumb. Come on. That's par. I'll take it. I'll take it. You know, I'm not going to complain. I'll complain about getting par. Or we could go try some pasta in Italy. That sounds nice. There's a historical museum of spaghetti. That sounds lovely. Destroying cups and taking names. I'm just draining it, man. From downtown. From two zip codes away. Making these shots look easy when they're not. You know, that's what I do. Here in mini golf. Okay, we got a par four here. Okay, this is tricky because you see there's holes here. There's openings in the planks. There's no barrier, which is awful for me because I usually overshoot everything. So if I overshoot it, it's going to roll off and get stuck over here or fall in the water and I'll have to restart. So what I want to do is I want to just hit it enough to have it rest here, right? That's what I want, and then I'll hit it over there, and then I'll hit it in. I think that's that's all I can hope for. I can't get fancy with this one. I have to play it safe. If I get a bogey or a par or you know something like that, that's okay. It's gonna be all right because we are negative three right now. I have some room. Okay, just enough to get out in the open. That's all I want. Just enough. There it is. There it is. Perfect. All right, that was excellent. Now, now I need to hit this just enough to get near the hole. I mean, if I can get it in, that'd be even better, but I'm not gonna pretend that's likely. But it's more likely than you thought it was, right? Look at that, look at that. Okay, and just like that, boys and girls, we have a birdie. There it is. Negative four. BD, thank you for the star eyes. I appreciate it. The winter of 1911-1932, where it's cold, the Niagara Falls froze. That is a fun fact. That's interesting. That's a very good fun fact. Did you know, everybody, did you know that if you become a member on our YouTube channel, you get access to these awesome little emotes in chat where you can post these cool emotes. Look at that. Look at how fun that is. Don't you wish you could do that? You have to become a member in order to do that. With the low, low cost of $20,000. I'm just kidding. I think it's $5 a month, something like that. It's, it's like Twitch. 
You get access to emotes. You get a little badge, fancy badge next to your name. There we go. Got another lost ball. Okay, this one. This is only a par three? How? Oh. Oh, should I go for that? Do you guys think I can make that across the plank? Or should I play it safe and try to loop around the edge and just go for the, the roundabout? The roundabout loop shot. That's what I call it. What do you guys think? I'll, I'll take votes. Walk the plank. Okay, Mike Ward. Sign up. You love playing $20,000 a month for three months. <laughs> if you go to our main page, uh, G-Dog, the main channel page, you can click on join. It's a join button. Just getting started says, do not play it safe. Mike Ward says, walk the plank. All right. All right. The people have spoken. The people have spoken, ladies and gentlemen. Boys and girls of all ages, shapes and sizes. We are going to walk the plank here. We're going to go down with style. Oh, wait. Hold on. How many have I found so far? I've only found four? I thought I found more than that. Do we have any uh, any hiders over here? Anyone trying to be trying to be tricky? Cause I don't think that counted. I think that counted for the other hole. Oh wait, yeah, that was the one ahead of me. I'm on hole nine. So there's there's a hidden ball over here that I haven't found yet. I don't know where it's at. I've got no idea where it's at. Curve shot. Okay. You know what? I'm going for it. Sorry, G-Dog. Two votes, two votes for Walk the Plank came in real quick. So I think that's what we got to do. We got to just go for it, man. You know? You can't live in fear. You can't, you can't pretend like you can't do something. Just like, just like you said earlier. Visualize it. Make it happen. Be the ball. I'm going to visualize myself going across this plank and I'm going to get it. I'm not going to get a hole in one. I'm not going to pretend I'm that good. But I am going to get across this plank right now. Watch this. Watch this. See that right there? That perfect straight and narrow, straight, straight and straight and shot right here. It's coming, man. Here it comes. You ready? Ah, <gasps> uh, <laughs> I'm counting it. That totally counts. <laughs> oh man, that was terrifying. Can I get an eagle? You guys think I'm gonna get an eagle right now? Let's see. Oh. close oh that was so close I had no business being that close still got a birdie though oh that was par oh, this is the par three oh, okay oh, that was a par four ever hole have a hidden ball yes it does <laughs> just getting started thank you I did great thanks yes every hole has a hidden ball I don't know where this hole's hidden ball is is it one of these objects? Is it like... Oh, you know what? Is it over here? No, I can't go up in there. This one is very well hidden. I have no idea where it's at. Yeah, no idea. <clears throat> Hmm. Oh well. You're halfway done with this course. Yeah, BD, this game's pretty awesome. How do you stream quests on YouTube? Am I tethered to a PC jiggler? No, I am not. I'm streaming via Chromecast. That's how you do it. Uh, if you Google upload VR how to stream quests, you'll find our article. Basically, I am casting to a Chromecast, which is plugged into an HDMI splitter, which is then plugged into my capture card. That's the, uh, the gist of it. Okay, let's see here. So I need to hit this, right? If I hit this, where does it, where does it shoot out? This is a par three, but where does this shoot out at? 
Oh, okay. So it'll spurt out. So I think what I need to do is the best way to approach this is I want to hit this with enough force that if I miss the hole, it'll go around the entire loop, right? That's the ideal way to do it. But if I can hit that, if I can hit the hole, that'd be even better. So let's try that. Yeah, okay, see? That's exactly what I wanted. Make it around the whole loop, please. Come on, you can do it. I believe. I believe in you. Perfect. That is totally fine. I'm still negative four right now. I'm, I'm doing fine. Oops. Here we go. Okay. I'm gonna sink the shot. That's what I'm gonna do right now. See that? See that? Oh. I keep curving it, man. I gotta get my shot in line. There. All right. Not too bad. Not too bad. Hit it as hard as you can. Sorry about that. I uh, missed your comment. Just getting started. Next time I have an opportunity to really drill one, I'll do it for you. Okay? Because of all your positive reinforcement. Oh, hey. Okay, not as hard as I can, but I'm going to hit it pretty hard on this one. Because I want it to ramp up there, but I don't want it to come back. So not, not too hard. I don't want it to bounce back. There, I think that's perfect. Nice. Okay, so I got two more shots. Money. Oh, dang, come on. There we go. I'm gonna take these cars all day. I don't care. I'm at negative four right now. I'm okay. No, uh, sorry, G Dog. That would have been a bad idea because I didn't want it to bounce back all the way. I haven't found a hidden ball in so. Oh, there we go. Perfect. All right, so this one is tricky. Look at that. That's that's nasty. That's very mean. Because if I hit that too hard, it's going to get stuck in that corner. And if I don't hit it hard enough, it'll get stuck in this corner, right? Isn't that what... Oh, wait. Oh. Oh, there's a ball down there. I'll have to remember that. Why is this such an elaborate hole? This is so crazy. So I want it to go in the middle, right? But I don't want it to go in that one. That's the worst. I would rather... Okay. Okay. I think I see what I have to do. I don't want to hit it too hard. It's just kind of... Oh, that was too hard. Oh, wait. There was a hole there. Okay, I thought it would get stuck in the corner. That wasn't too bad. Okay, we're at a par 3 still. Okay. Alright, this is like a straight shot. This is actually not that bad at all. There we go. <gasps> oh, man. That was so close. I'll take that par. Thank you, thank you. Clap, clap, clap. Round of applause. Yes. Great game, been playing with your kids. That's awesome, Jason. May need to start calling your bank. You keep not getting this money you talk about. <laughs> I got burgled on that hole. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have have to be making a phone call to my bank, you're right. Because I have not found that money in the bank that I keep talking about. You have called me out successfully, sir. Or madam. Okay. Oh, if I really wanted to get to get tricky, I could just wail on it and launch it over that way. But I don't think that's possible. This has a barrier wall. This is safe. I'm just going to do that. I'm, I don't think there's any chance I'll get it. I'll get it that way. Oh, 
Wow. That really went fast. Okay. I think that went faster than I thought it was going to, but it worked out perfectly fine. <clears throat> okay, here it is. This is my chance to get a birdie and get ahead even further. Ah, I was trying to make sure I didn't curve it to the left. And as a result, I curved it to the right. Man. See, I got it that time. That was the same distance. Sir would be right. All right, G-Dog is a male cheeseburger. Good to know. Oh, right there. Oh, that's a pirate ball. That's cool. How many do I have now? I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, I need three more. Actually, I'm probably going to get under par, right? I'm at negative four still. Ah, oh, look at that. They want you to launch it. Okay. Okay. Oh, no. Okay, I hit it way too hard. There we go. You forget how bouncy those things are, man. This is a par four? All right, all right, let's do it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have a shot where I feel really confident at some point here. And I'm going to say money in the bank. And I'm going to get that money in the bank. And then G-Dog Cheeseburger is going to feel awful for making that joke. You know that? That's what's going to happen. Like right now. This is it. This is the shot. This is the money in the bank shot. All that money I keep talking about. I'm going to get it all right now. Right here on the shot. Sinking the shot. Crushing it. Killing that hole. Here we go. Get ready. Here it is. <clears throat> it's going to look a nice little flourish. Right there, alrighty, and boom. <laughs> Alright, well, that's fine. It's, uh, it's okay. I still got the birdie. Nope, I got the par. I'm stupid. Why did I think that? I keep thinking they're par four when they're really just par three. Oh, man. Um, where, where's the hidden, the hidden ball for this one? Oh, you know what? I bet it's over here. Because I don't think you're going to backtrack and search. They don't know me, though. They think that I'm lazy and I'm not going to look for the ball. They would be wrong. Did I find this one already? No, I didn't. Huh. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Oh well. They were right. I am lazy. Okay. This will probably be my last course. After this one, I think we're going to stop. So I want to go up here. I want to curve it. And I want to hit there and curve it. So, okay, so I need to put some force behind this one. Not a ton, but I do need to get some momentum. Because I want to hit both of those curves. Whoops. Nope, that's not really what I wanted. And this is a par 3, so that sucks. Okay. Alright, well, let's just try to get it over by the hole, right? There we go. Okay. I can work with this. This is still possible for par. It's still possible. Not that possible. This is this is bad, guys. Alright, cool. One bogey. That's okay. I'm negative three. It's alright. It's alright. Everyone calm down. Don't panic. Relax. Don't freak out on me, okay? Because the 18th hole on walkabout... Have a fun hole and one type challenge like mini golf courses? Yeah, yeah, they do, Matt Miko. Yeah. Teleportable mini golf. Yeah, I mean, I, I can physically walk around. I just don't have much space in this, in this room that I'm in in my office. 
But yeah, teleport about would be probably the more accurate description. Well, here we go. Here we go. Wait. So the hidden ball on this one must be very close. Because the whole course is right here. Right? Where are they hiding this one? Oh, right there. There we go. Okay. Here it is. This is a part two. Part oh, this is a three. Okay. Okay. I can make up some ground here. Look at that. That was a thing of beauty, if I do say so myself. Birdie. Ka-ching, ka-ching. Back to negative four. We're almost to the top. Oh, this is terrifying. There's no walls. I don't like that at all. This is super terrifying. Um, okay, where is the hidden ball on this one? It's usually near the hole, I feel like. Most of the time. Oh, right there. Okay. Okay. Alright. Let's see if I can do it. Oh, that was beautiful. I can't believe it. I actually got it. And it just barely nicked off there at the end, right? See if you watch. Watch the shot. It almost fell in right there at the end. But I got it. Another birdie. I'm pulling away, guys. We're at negative five now. I don't even know where the hole's at. Okay. Comes down here. And then it goes down here. Then it goes, wow. This one's very elaborate. Okay. So what I need to do is I need to get it in this little crack. But I gotta get it up the ramp first. This is a par six. Oh my god. Okay. There it is. Okay. Alright. Looking good. Looking good. I like this. I like the trajectory. Alright. That was a good first shot. I gotta get it in this crack. There it is. Looking good, everybody. Alright. Now we've got to get in the next one. <gasps> oh, I popped out. Damn it. Okay. So this is four hits now. Here it comes. Okay, we can still get a birdie. I've only had four hits. Alright. Oh! Man! Oops. That's alright, I got par. Negative five. out Elijah can you set game to putter does not swing through objects Dwayne 
good question. Good question. Putter, invert hands, grip to putt, um, auto center, stroke limit, sound effects. No, it doesn't look like you can. It only has collision with the ball. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. That's really cool. And there you go. Now I have the night version, the hard version. Cool. All right, well, this game's pretty awesome. It sucks we weren't able to do uh, multiplayer because of the audio issue. Uh, but thank you everybody for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed watching some Walkabout Mini Golf. I had fun playing. I actually liked this game a lot. It was far better than I uh, really expected, to be honest. And yeah, so thank you very much for watching. Make sure you check out UploadVR.com for all your latest VR news, reviews, interviews, and more. Here on our YouTube channel, we have lots of great gameplay footage, reviews, interviews, um, lots of exclusive content that you won't find anywhere else. Uh, we've also got our membership set up on YouTube. If you want to hit the join button on our channel, you get access to exclusive nifty little emotes in the chat and a nice little badge next to your name during live streams. Um, you can also, of course, go to Amazon and type upload VR t-shirt and buy a t-shirt there with our logo on it if you'd like to support the page and support the website. So thank you everybody for hanging out in the chat. I appreciate it. And uh, I'll see you guys again next week on Monday is uh, when we record our episode of the podcast that focuses on industry topics at 1 p.m. here on our YouTube, 1 p.m. Pacific, and then Thursday at uh, usually around 10.30 a.m. Pacific, we record the gaming-focused version of our podcast, so make sure you tune in for those, and uh, yeah, so thank you very much. I'll see you guys next time.